Well, the New York Times reviewed it as 90 minutes of good kinky fun. Two of our Kiwi actors living across the ditch have returned home to star in Auckland Theatre Company's version of the steamy, award-winning two-handed play, Venus and Fur. Welcome Craig Hall and Morgana O'Reilly. Thank you. Ah, and there you are. Hello. Looking decidedly more clothed. Just Lovely to have you guys bed. here. That's what I actually looked like this morning when I woke up. I was that's, so tired, guys. It's funny. That's how I wake up too. Exactly the same. Just yeah, absolutely yeah. immaculate. Yeah, um, Morgana, tell us a little bit about the show. Okay, so, okay. This is okay. a hard thing to describe too, isn't so, it? So, the play is based on an 1870 novel from Germany, about which was kind of the first dominatrixy kind of saucy novel okay. of its time. Okay. Ooh. Um, a man called David Ives adapted it into a play and took it to his friend Walter Bobby as a director and said, what do you think of this? He said, nobody wants to see anyone getting whipped for an hour and a half. And he went, well. oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, sure. <laughs> and then, um, except Craig. Um, <laughs> and he took it away and made this play, which is a play within a play, um, about a director looking for the perfect actress to play the part of Vanda in the book. So it's an audition. It's in an audition room, and so we switch between <coughs> being uh, in Germany and then in yeah. New York. Direct Clear it up here? Then... Yep, no, no, yeah. I've got with it. With me, with me? Yeah, no, no, it sounds kinky. <laughs> sounds good. Let's all have a nap. <laughs> <laughs> now, Craig, I guess with the, just two of you on stage, is it gruelling, or do you find it a little bit easy when you only have one other person to work with? Uh, it's kind of, it's kind of, it's kind of nerve-wracking. You've got nowhere to hide. You mm. just, you, you're on, and you've just got to be focused and in, in there with the other person, which is great also, because it's just us. It's just, right. you know. Mm. Um, uh, but it is a little bit daunting, but it's it's ultimately fun. You'd have to yeah. be making sure that you got on extremely well, or you're very good actors, of which you probably are both, by the sounds of things. <laughs> oh, we're totally well, both. Yeah. <laughs> now, Morgana, I, I am really interested because you've come back to the stage for this uh, after yep. we saw you in Housebound, of course, which was mm -hmm. magnificent. Mm. You've got a little baby daughter. Yes. So you're on stage with practically nothing on, uh, less than a year after having your baby. Uh, well, one year today. One year today? It's Thursday. Nice. It's her birthday. Wow. Oh, happy birthday. Happy birthday, birthday <laughs> Lena. Um, so, so this must be, this is quite a daunting thing for any woman to do. Yeah, it's actually been really great. It's actually been so lovely to have spent a beautiful year with my daughter being a mum for the first time and then being able to come into a show like this and just really harness my, like, female sexual power to be this character. It's really nice. Flip. Was it difficult though? Because usually when you come back to work you've got clothes on and you essentially don't have many on for the show. Well, there is actually a lot of clothes on. It just gives the illusion of not much clothes. And I've been in <laughs> such good hands yeah. with um, a shoot. Elizabeth Wilkins. <laughs> <There's a shoot. laughs> <That's laughs> yes, but even that, look, see, people go, oh, it's so saucy. You're like, well, actually, She's got tracky -tackies on. I've got a lot <laughs> covered. Yeah, I was milking the sheep. Anyway. Um, oh. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Too much. Too much. Too much. It's natural, it's real. Um, uh, yeah, no, but it's been, it's been really <clears> awesome. It's actually felt really natural to, to do this. So and, and I guess, Craig, too, with you, I mean, we were having a conversation before in the air break. Um, you are quite naked in the show as well. Do men have specific type of underwear to help them in those circumstances? <laughs> I'm, more, I'm more naked... Um, Under his clothes. Like, uh, psychologically. Naked. Right. Yeah, 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 yeah. But I do, as we were talking about, I do wear a, a special pair of underwear right. in the show. Special right. undies. Yeah, special undies. I guess you don't have to wear those <laughs> really? special undies yeah. when you're acting alongside your wife. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yeah. Because you... A place to call home. No special undies when I'm... Obviously, my wife. Yeah, because you start in a place to call sure. home with your with your wife, Sarah yes. Wiseman. Uh, so no special undies involved. How's that working alongside your wife as opposed to working alongside Morgana? Uh, Watch it's... what you say very carefully oh. right now. Remember, um... one is beside you, one is your wife. <laughs> well, um, to speak of working with, with my wife, it's a, it's an absolute gift because we spend as actors we spend so much time apart, different cities, different jobs. So to be in the same city, same job, working together is just you know it's been a real gift and. Uh, and I admire her as an actress, so it's incredible to work with her. Um, as for old bugger logs over here. <laughs> you know, um, no, I've always uh, held Morgana up as, a, a, you know, in high regard as an actress, and I, I love her method of uh, work, and I love the work that she uh, produces. So mm -hmm. it's, it was a real gift. It was a real gift yeah. to, to come and work with Morgan. And, and what brings you, what brings you guys back to do stage? Because I know you've done some amazing movies, done some amazing television. Is, is stage where it really is at for you guys? Is that what you love the most? What makes you come back and do a show like this? Well, it's, I mean, it's always so lovely when everything works out to be able to come and do theatre. Because it really, I mean, I always think there's that wonderful uh, saying, is it, what it, like, 
TV makes you money, movies make you famous, and theatre makes you good. Yeah. Oh, good. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, oh, yeah. I've got those slightly mixed up. So yeah. what's next for you guys? Um, well, <laughs> <laughs> this is what you ask actors, and they always go, can I talk about that project? Am I allowed to talk about that yeah, project? Yeah, yeah. I don't have much on. I'm going to be yeah, relaxing. Can I talk about that yeah. massive yeah. big blockbuster that... Um, <laughs> You're getting signed <laughs> for you. Yeah, yeah. Talk to me about... We're, we're in talks, yeah. There's um, heaps on the go. <laughs> um, no, we're going down... I'm going down to the South Island um, for the second half of the year for my husband's work. And so I'll be um, looking at the remarkables, feeling nice. remarkable awesome. about it. And who knows? And Craig? Who knows? Um, <laughs> I've got a little gig uh, lined up at the end of the year. Uh, sort of returning on Dr. Blake um, Mysteries, possibly. I don't know if I, know if I can say that. But, um, <laughs> KG, OK. <laughs> okay. Anyway. But yeah, KG, KG, KG. We'll KG. save you. We'll end it. Yeah. 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 <laughs> nice. Yep. Hey, well, an absolute pleasure having you both. Um, yeah. Can't wait to see this play. I know it's Can running already. It. Yes, we will. And Craig and Morgana's play Venus in Fur is running at Auckland's Herald Theatre until the 18th of September. Check out the Auckland Theatre Company website for details on how you can get your tickets. Go and see it. You will not regret it.